we are currently at Disney Springs. It's gonna be a fun night. We are celebrating Timber's birthday. So we're gonna go to the boathouse. We have a reservation here in like 20 minutes. And then um, right now we're currently on our way to pick up the Orange Bird annual pass holder magnet. We got in the virtual queue, super easy to do. Heading over there now to do that. And then after that, we're gonna head to the boathouse. Now, Flavors of Florida just started here at Disney Springs as well. And I believe at the boathouse there is an item that's on that menu, but this video is not really gonna be focused on Flavors of Florida. Just the boathouse, your birthday, and getting this magnet. Let's go check it out. Now the pass holder magnet is located at World of Memories, which is just gonna be over here. And joining the virtual queue is super easy. We actually joined it like at our house. So you don't have to be super close to Disney to join it. You can probably be, I think they say 45 to 50 miles, but you can be, I mean, 70, it seems like. And then just walk over there, do the entry code, and you'll be able to show your pass and get your magnets. And as we're crossing the bridge, if we turn this way, you can see the boathouse right over there and the amphi cars right in the water and you can see just across from the christmas store and the art of disney annual pass holder magnet distribution available magnet distribution so they have really good signage that lets you know where to go again magnet redemption all pass holders must be present to redeem magnet each pass holder should have their annual pass and photo ID ready. And then you'll get with one of these cast members, they'll scan the QR code on your phone, then you'll head over to this line there. And you can see through the window here, they are doing the distribution of the magnets. And they also have an orange bird scavenger hunt map, which it looks like you can pick one up right here as well. You can kind of see how the line winds around in here doesn't really appear to be that long of a wait. All right, we've got them. So here's the magnet. They come to life when you scan. And then we picked up the scavenger hunt. I don't know if we'll have time to do it tonight or not, but I at least wanted to have it. So that really isn't that hard of a process, but now we're gonna book it over to the boathouse because we've got a reservation. It's time to get in. Now I looked online and it says mobile check-in is not available at the boathouse. So we'll just end up walking over there and checking in that way. Now this is only an annual pass holder scavenger hunt map. I'm not sure, I, I read online and I don't think there's really even a prize. I'm not sure, but like I said, I don't know if I'll we'll have time to do it or not. If you wanna know where the boathouse is, there's T-Rex, just right over here, past the paddlefish. You kinda of have to go around a little bit. As we round the corner, you can see the boathouse. And the boathouse does do the amphi cars as well, which not doing that tonight, but pretty cool to see. And then since there isn't mobile check-in, we're gonna head right up here, I guess to, oh, that's amphi car check-in. So maybe we head right inside here. Yes, we head right in here to check-in. Here's the inside with the oyster bar, some TVs. And we're gonna check in right up here at the counter. Looks pretty nice on the inside. So we got checked in and we actually chose outside seating. So we're waiting for them to call our name so we can get seated outside. But look at the boat. You can sit in this boat and dine. That's pretty cool. And then over here they have their own gift shop that we can check out after we eat. I'm just gonna do a walking tour. There's the restrooms through there right through there. Look at the fans, the booths. And we're heading outside. This is a big place. Wow. Love the decor. We're going all the way out here. Over to the right, which is definitely a water view, which will be nice. Here we are, right here. So I don't know if It'll pick it up, but there's a ton of bugs. Oh, you can kind of see right there, just flying around. So we actually requested if we could go inside because I mean, I don't know if you can see 
there's there's a bunch of them. So I think we're gonna see if we can go inside. Our waiter is really nice. He said that's we're actually the second people in a row that had to see if we could move because of the bugs. So heading inside. So thank you. That particular table has had several people request to come inside because of the bugs, but it wasn't really much of a breeze behind the wall either. So it's actually gonna feel better inside than it is outside. So just kind of make a note of that. If it's a warm day, you may want to set inside and not outside. So we got seated right by the oyster bar, which is really cool. This is a good seat here. Let's take a look at the menu. That's a large, large menu. I'm just gonna kind of do one of these here. And then if we turn it to the other side, holy smokes, this is a huge, menu. I know this is like the drink side, but look how many drinks they have. That's insane. And again, back to the food. I don't see any, I'm trying to look and see any gluten-free options. I'm not seeing any there. But the menu is online. If you go to the Disney website, look up the boathouse, you'll be able to see the menu. I just looked in this duck duck Raz drink has a little um, duck that floats on top of the drink. Now they did say they bring bread to the table, so you get bread included with the meal, which she's going to get right now. Also, I went with the Duck Duck Raz to see if they do have the little duck in it. I am with my parents and I know my mom's getting the chopped salad. My dad might be getting, I don't know how to pronounce this, but the this one where my thumb's at, I don't know how to pronounce that. And then Timber and I are gonna share something. I'm just not sure yet what we're gonna get. And here's the bread they bring to the table. Since it's your birthday, what'd you say you want? Salmon. So we're gonna get the, the Cedar Plank Gulf of Maine salmon. All right, a lot going on there. We had ordered chips and dip or something. And then the salmon, it came with the salad listed underneath it, but you could substitute it out for another salad or for any side item. So we ended up getting the jumbo sweet potato with cinnamon butter as our side. And like I said, we ordered some. What were the appetizer? Chips and duo dips and chips. Duo <laughs> chips and dip. Duo dip and chips. That's very confusing. And check this out. Here is that drink with the little rubber duck on top. That's really cool. We're gonna give that a try. And also the buttered up rolls. Is it good? Did you try it? Very good. All right, here's the drink. That is excellent. It tastes like a blue raspberry, almost like a slurpy thing you get at the movies. That tastes really good. And then here is the blueberry lemonade drink that my dad got. That's a good size. I think the rolls might have honey on the top, but I'm, I'm ready to try this. Here we go. Those are taste. Those are. They're stinking good. Mm -hmm. Those are stinking good rolls overall. Everybody at the table agrees right now, stinking good rolls. Good. 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 <laughs> stinking good rolls. These are great. Like, it's worth it to get a reservation and come here and get the rolls. Look at that honey. That is very good. And now they just brought the dips and chips. It's got some kind of seasoning on top. And then what, pimento cheese? Probably might be the boathouse. And then what, pimento cheese and salsa? Is that what the two yeah. were? Yeah, that looks tasty too. Let's try the salsa first. Here's the salsa. That salsa, that salsa's good. Now time for the pimento cheese. There we go. Oh, it's tasty. I like it. You've never tried it before, have you? Do you like it? It is? Slightly, slightly spicy. Definitely has some spice to it. So we definitely finished the rolls. Now we're working on the spread still. All right, so we ask if they do anything for birthdays and you get a free dessert. So you can get a chocolate cupcake or she's gonna bring the dessert menu. Are you gonna share with us? Depends what the dessert is. Chocolate cupcake sounded pretty good. That does sound good. And they put a little candle on it too, they said. All right, all the foods here. Here's the salmon with the huge baked potato 
and the cinnamon butter. Look at that, that looks great. Here's the huge chopped salad, that's massive. And then over here is the thing we can't pronounce, but looks very good. Type of pasta. What is it? It's a type of pasta. Type of pasta, so everything looks great. Also, you can get more bread and more chips because we still have the salsa to finish, so she's gonna bring us more bread and more chips. Here is what the salmon looks like cut in half. That looks really, really good. And like I said, we're getting that sweet potato fixed up now with that cinnamon butter. That looks so good. I'm gonna do a little uh, lemon on top. A lemon on top there. All right, giving the salmon a taste. Wow. Salmon, very good salmon. Really, really good salmon. Got more chips, got more bread. Salmon's amazing. I don't know what they put on top, but it's very, very good. How's yours? Good and healthy. Good and healthy. Yours good? Very good. It's a very large salad. Now it's time to try the sweet potato. Cinnamon butter makes everything better. That is very good. All right, we finished the salmon. We're working on the sweet potato. Almost done over there. We're working on the salsa and then some more rolls. All right, we are finishing up, waiting for the dessert menu for the birthday girl. The kids' meals have Amphicar little like plates. That's really cool. I finished my drink and here's our little rubber ducky. <laughs> Great hits in here too. Mom cry. Stranger Things fans, the plane running up that hill in the background. That is like the hit right now. Such a good song. If you haven't seen the last season of Stranger Things, definitely recommend watching it. Best part of the song. Here is the dessert menu we just asked. So the cupcake, is free but she can put a candle in any of these desserts it's not free but they can put a candle in it for a birthday and right here this is what i was talking about the disney springs flavors of florida inspirations from the sunshine states they do have a coconut panna cotta which has all of this stuff in it i don't think we're gonna get that i think what you're just going with the cupcake because we're stuffed and here is the birthday cupcake with the candle it says happy birthday there make a wish no, make a wish. We're good. <laughs> or what about like the restaurant style? Happy, happy birthday. Hey. Woohoo! Now, like I said before, this is the free dessert for your birthday. You can put a candle in any of the other dessert, but you still have to pay the price. All right, dig in. Don't eat the candle though. That would be bad. It's not a sugar candle, it's a real candle. Good stuff. There's the birthday cupcake. It's a regular cupcake. But hey, it's free on your birthday. I'm not sure if you keep the ducks or not, so we might have to ask. I just ask and you get to keep the ducks. And they squeak. Oh, what? Very cool. Also, there's annual pass holder discounts at this location. And here is the receipt. So it's $123.81. However, we got an annual pass holder discount which showed up on the actual one. And that took about $7 off. So the total after that was $116. It actually took the tax off pretty much. So, all right, now we are leaving. We're gonna head over to the boutique. I like to play on words there. Their little gift shop. Let's see what all they got here. Call me old fashioned. What do we have under here? Oh, the little, that's really neat. Here's the little Amphicar ducks. Those are $21.99, they got different colors. Got the patriotic stuff over here. I'm sorry for what I said when I was docking the boat. <laughs> Captain's hat, and some socks, look at those. That's funny. Some hats, shirts. You like this, like this store? vacay i like that that's pretty cool some cups more shirts this is actually a really big gift shop custom designs i wonder if you can do like on the the little lifesavers floaties the little life floaties but you can do a custom design a very cool gift shop got a lot of stuff in here looks like there's what is this like a oh a magnet 
and little tiny duckies. All right, that was the gift shop, which is really cool. And then out here, they do have a bar, this little cool looking boat. And then of course the Ampha cars. There they go. Very cool. I'm not sure if we're gonna do this or not, but maybe if we walk by one, we'll see if we can like spot Orange Bird or something. Yes. So for the most part, the video was gonna be us going to the boathouse, also picking up our annual pass holder magnet. And then if we see Orange Bird around, we'll film that too. But as far as the restaurant went, I really have no complaints. The only complaint I can have is when we set outside first, we were behind that wall, so it was very stuffy and hot. And there were all those bugs flying around and the waiter, yeah, and the waiter said, second table in a row to be moved from that spot. So I would say if during the summer hours, you can set inside, that would be the better time. They definitely play hits. They definitely have a great menu. I think I had like four rolls, so I'm absolutely stuffed. No complaints on the food whatsoever. That's very good. Just make sure you get a reservation because it's not really like a walk up place. It's definitely get a reservation, get it sealed in, and then there's not mobile check in. Day up, yeah, yeah, you can get them day of. So overall, with that restaurant, very, very pleased. We are going to stop at Pen Traders up over here, and I think there's an Orange Bird location over in that area. So we're going to head up this way, go over there. Got some music playing over here, good crowd. And right here you can see Disney Springs flavors of Florida. We are going to head into Pen Traders right now. They're bringing back all the resort pens. The one we lack is Riverside. Port Orleans Riverside is what we lack. So I'm going to see if they've got it in here. Here's some of the limited edition ones they've got. It looks like all they have right now is Fort Wilderness, Polynesian. Those two. Oh, that's pretty neat. You like single yeah, that's cool. Oh, contemporary. They also have contemporary. Over here in the theme park and resorts area, it looks like they've got some more. Let's see. Do we see Caribbean Beach, Boardwalk, Contemporary, Riviera, All Star? Man, they do have some more. Old Key West. I do not see. Riverside right at the moment, but oh Hilton Head, yeah, that is cool. Wilderness Lodge, we already have a couple of those. Sarasota Springs, Beach Club, Coronado Springs. So yeah, they actually have quite a bit out right now. But like I said, the one oh there's Pop. The one we're missing is Riverside, and I don't see it out. We're gonna get one of the Tiny Kingdom packets. Oh, there you go. Oh yes. Awesome. Getting you the birthday pin. Yes, I am. Awesome. I can't believe we thought you could go to Disney <laughs> on your birthday <laughs> and not have a button. I hear you now. Timber. Thank you. Timber pen. Thank you. Thank you. Did you get it on? Woohoo! Happy birthday. Woo We're going to head over to this little ledge and see if by chance we can get some real good winners here on the Tiny Kingdom. That cast member got good vibes on this one. Yeah, she was sweet. She was very, very, sweet. very sweet cast member. Here are the three we got. We got Dale, the oh mini name gosh. badge, and then the pirates just found out they got the exact same three. Come on, Disney, what are you doing? We bought two. That's kind of a crock. And they're, and they're the exact, look. look. Well, yeah, because what if you'd have bought two? Right? Yeah, we would have got the I'm exact saying. same thing. Yeah, that's that stinks. Yeah. Uh, but the good news is two of these we don't have, only one. It looks like there is Rainforest Cafe. That looks like E. These two might be the, I don't know, is that like the Christmas store? And then next to the Christmas store? I feel like I'm like right in the location for Orange Bird. So one clue down here says celebrate holiday cheer throughout. So I know Holiday cheer has to be days of Christmas. Has to be. So there has to be an orange bird somewhere around the Christmas store. Okay, I think I found it. So right where we got our magnet, right across from that, there is an orange bird right here on the window. And I'm guessing that would be what this, is that an, an O, I guess? 
So if we were doing this, we would write O right here next to celebrate holiday cheer throughout this year at this festive store brimming with jolly decor and so much more. So that's what it's gonna look like. I could be completely wrong, but even looking at the map, I did not see where there's like any sort of prize that you redeem. It just seems like you go and you do the scavenger hunt however you want to do and you just do it for your joy, I guess. So that seems kind of weird. I wish they really did have a prize at the end of it. They, you know, normal ones like at the Christmas tree stroll during um, like December, they have on the map like several redemption locations and on this one they don't have any. So I don't think you get a prize. It's just for your own enjoyment walking around seeing the different orange birds. I always love Disney Springs at nighttime when the lights start turning on. Look at the amazing sunset we have over here. Now one thing we're going to do before we leave is get Starbucks because if you have the Starbucks app, they give you a free drink on your birthday. So, free Starbucks drink on our birthday. Down over here is the Starbucks we're going to go to before we leave. Let's give this a listen. Doesn't appear to be too crowded, so that's perfect. We'll get the free birthday coffee or drink, whatever she wants. All right, I went with a little strawberry lemonade refresher, and I haven't seen it. What are those again? The Trenta. Trenta, massive. Since back in like the, um, we did the dining plan. Oh yeah. Kind of like a snack or Yeah, more. haven't seen one of those in forever, but free birthday drink, so why not, right? Yep. <laughs> All right, that was our trip down to Disney Springs for Tim's birthday. Thank you for picking the boathouse. That was a really good pick. Uh, something different? Yeah. It was good. It was, it was good. It was excellent. It was very good. I definitely recommend it. I want to try the paddlefish. Paddlefish next. Yeah, we'll have to do that next time. Um, overall, a fun night. Look at your huge, massive, I mean, here's a tall, and then there's the big one. So, um, overall, happy birthday. Thanks. Glad I got to spend it with you. And glad I got to eat a great meal with you. Yes. So, that being said, that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.